Mba. is a cap wearing and cloth wearing APC member. And this is the evidence of that here. This is the evidence of a man who has not been appointed to that. So you can see that. Yeah. So you can see that as a member. Not only is he a card carrying member, it's a cap wearing and a dress wearing APC member. So that tells you that we're in, we, we seem to be in trouble in this country. This is another hymn where he was being received, where we were celebrating his membership of APC. Echekemba Umaren is a known APC leader who has been at the forefront of APC campaigns and unrelated projection of APC's interest in previous elections. The PDP, therefore, in clear and unequivocal times, reject the imposition of Echekemba Umaren as INEC Craig in Akwa Ibom State being conceived in iniquity and in a flagrant violation of the express provisions of the Constitution of the Federal Republic of Nigeria 1999 as amended, the Electoral Act 2022, and the universal demand of impartiality and non-partisanship of an electoral body and its officials. It is imperative to state that Section 141 of the Electoral Act 2022 is clear and unambiguous in barring partisan persons like APC's Etekamba Umoren from holding any position even whatsoever in the island. Any position whatsoever, a partisan person is barred under that section. And for clarity and emphasis, Section 141 of the Electoral Act states that, and I quote, this is the provision of the law, Electoral Act 2022. No person holding an elective office to which this act relates or a registered member of a political party, the emphasis there, a registered member of a political party shall be eligible for or be appointed to carry out the duties of a returning officer, an electoral officer, a presiding officer, or a poor clerk, as little as a poor clerk. If you're a card carry member, you cannot hold those positions. That's the provision of the law. Section 141 of the Electoral Act 2022 is clearly a major provision that confers, affirms, and protects INEC statutory independence and is meant to guarantee its impartiality and non-partisanship in the electoral process. The violation of this key provision, as in the case of Etekamba's Umoron, is a grievous assault on INEX credibility as an institution of democracy and the sanctity of the electoral process. Our parties are aware of the mission allegedly handed to Etekamba Umoren by the APC leadership to use the office of the REC in Akwaibom state to compromise sensitive processes, namely material and systems including voters' registration, collection of voter cards, doctoring of voter register, delineation of electoral constituencies, and coercion of high next staff or to lay the foundation for APC to manipulate the process leading to future elections in the state. Echekamba Umoren's imposition as INEC REC for Aqua Ibom State is therefore a provocative and vexatious defilement of the independence, integrity, and credibility of our electoral system, which cannot be allowed to stand. This imposition has started generating serious agitation, which is a recipe for crisis and possible breakdown of law and order in Akwa Ibom State, if not immediately addressed. It is instructive to alert that the import of the violation of, this, of Section 141 of the Electoral Act 2022 
is to the effect that any election conducted or superintended by a Tekamba Umeran will be subject to illegitimacy on the ground that the electoral body is constituted contrary to and in violation of the Electoral Act 2022. It is clear that the people of Akwa Ibom State, being very knowledgeable with respect to the position of the law, will never allow such obnoxious imposition aimed to frustrate their will at elections. Moreover, the underlying substance, essence, and significance of Section 14.3 of the 1999 Constitution, as amended, is for appointment into federal agencies, especially sensitive agencies like INEC, to be made in such a manner to, quote, promote national unity and also to command national loyalty. The provocative imposition of a card carrying member and a known leader of the APC as high neck wreck in Akwa Ibom State, which has resulted in tension in the state, is at the variance and in desecration of the express provision, intent, and purpose of Section 14.3 of the 1999 Constitution as amended, accused by the Economic and Financial Crime Commission of allegedly conniving to loot billions of naira belonging to Aqua Ibom State while he was in the service of the state. The Tekamba Warren having been thus accused and being a card-carrying member and leader of the APC, runs short of the necessary criteria required to occupy the position of a REC. A REC should be known to be a non-partisan individual of high integrity and whose conduct and appearance should exude confidence in the electorate and enhance the legitimacy of any election supervised by him. The Tekamba Omoran should therefore say clear of INEC office in Akwa Ibom State. President Bola Ahmed Tinubu should immediately commence the process of appointing a neutral resident electoral commissioner for Akwa Ibom State so as to avert crisis and illegitimacy in elections in the state in the future. I thank you very much for listening. This was West African country, African continent, and of course, indeed, the world having regards to our population as a country and the effect of any destabilization in this. So we are concerned about the stability of this country. So the text of this press conference is this. The PDP rejects imposition of APC leader Etikamba Umoren as Aqua Ibom State Resident Electoral Commissioner. As a party, we counsel him to stay clear of Aqua Ibom INEC office. And we demand that President Bola Abed Chinubu to appoint a neutral resident electoral commissioner. Gentlemen of the press, we've invited you again today to expose a dangerous design by the ever scheming all progressive Congress to perpetuate itself in power by annexing and manipulating the operations of the Independent National Electoral Commission, INEC. Of particular concern is the brazen imposition of a card carrying member and prominent leader of the APC in Aqua Ibom State, Mr. Etekamba Umoren, as the INEC resident electoral commissioner for Aqua Ibom State, despite the loud and widespread outcry and rejection by Nigerians, particularly our party, the PDP, and the people of Aqua Ibom State.